Just hours ago, Sandiaga reported our unemployment rate was a little more than 14%. Still, more than 250,000 San Diegans are out of work, and many of them are hurting financially. As part of our rebound initiative, we found a select group weathering this pandemic. They tell me their secret is FIRE. FIRE stands for Financial Independence, Retire Early. We profiled this group back in November. Hey, thanks for coming out. Last fall, we met Jennifer Ma, community liaison for the San Diego Fire chapter called Choose F5 before the screening of a documentary on the subject. And we learned then that many in this community save an average of 40% of their income. So we wanted to know, how are they doing now in the middle of this financial meltdown? But this is the first time in an economic downturn or instability that I've ever had a sense of strength. And Jennifer's not alone. She introduced us to two couples with very diverse stories. And as soon as quarantine started and I was laid off, you know, that was super scary for me. But not as scary for Grace and Mike Damazo had they not been part of the Choose FI community. Mike and Grace are a self-described frugal couple in their 30s. Yes, they save more than most their age, but they're also focused on investing in real estate. And before the pandemic hit, they also sold one of their cars to cut back on expenses. And if they travel, they do it with credit card bonuses. They meal prep to save instead of eating out. And if they do, they take advantage of happy hours or specials. And also definitely Grace uh, cutting my hair. You might laugh, but it all adds up. Mike's job is safe. He works in the Navy, so his job is essential. But Grace, a fitness instructor who was laid off by a big box gym, immediately transitioned her clients online. And the pandemic only has them doubling down on savings. It was a realization that this is the right path, for at least for us, and that we need to kind of fast track it. And then there is Wendy and Curtis Mays, a couple in their 50s with six kids. And if you think 50 is too late to start saving, think again. The Mays say they were in a million dollar hole just three years ago, and then they found Choose FI. It's been a long time of having that just fear in the back of our minds and to not have it anymore is just incredible. Yeah. Wendy and Curtis sold their house and started renting because they could save more money and pay down debt. Family outings are free when possible, like a trip to the beach. Hey everyone, welcome back. I am Wendy and I am one half of the House of Five podcast. They paid down so much debt, Wendy was able to quit her full-time job and now co-hosts her own financial consulting business. Curtis says the key is moving past the stigma of debt, talking with others and figuring out what works best for you. They're able to do it, we're able to do it. We just put it in our form with our platform, with our background, with our kids. Both couples were on what they call a 50-50 plan. 50% of their income goes straight to savings, 50% to pay down debt, which also includes expenses such as rent, utilities, and food. But in these uncertain times, they say they are saving even a little more because you never know what tomorrow will bring. Certainly don't.